Dear Mrs. Diliberti. Dear Dr. Fallman. Dear Angela. Dear Mr. Bowen. Dear Dr. King. Dear Mr. Hankins. Dear Mr. Michael Horn. Dear Mrs. Jimenez. I had you as a middle school principal about 25 years ago now. I had you as an AP physics teacher in high school. I had you for math. I had you first as my cheer coach, and then you became my mentor and friend. I had you for psychology. I just wanted you to know that you gave me the confidence to become a teacher. You always went that extra mile to make sure that we as students were understanding what we needed to know in your class. Your influence on my life helped shape the person that I am today. You taught me that to earn respect, you must give respect. I love your enthusiasm, I love your passion, and I love your commitment to your students as well as your job. The way you taught your class was unique because you always gave us practice for the real world, practice for the rest of our doctoral program. You never made me feel inferior or incapable of doing anything. The way you coached was inspiring. You taught me to push myself, not just when competing, but in life. You probably didn't realize it, but you've really influenced me over the years. And you really inspired us to really push forward and push towards our passions. You never coddled us or let us leave your classroom without comprehending the material. Jimenez, I love you. You are like the best teacher. So thanks to you. Thanks to you. Thanks to you. Thanks to you. I was inspired to earn two masters, and I'm working on my PhD here at Wayne State. I was inspired to earn a master of health education degree. I've been inspired to pursue my true interest and passion in poverty and justice. And now I have a career teaching art to students of all ages. I get to make students feel confident and understand that math is fun, like you did for me. I get to work with an entire school district, with students and staff, showing them how to make education in their classroom just that much better. You told me that when you love your job, it's always a passion and you never have to look at the clock. I just want to say thank you for being such a big part of my life. I'm grateful for your support and your guidance. Thanks for the life lesson, sir. You helped me find my future. So I just want to say thank you for giving me my first opportunity to teach and to seeing my opportunity to be an educator. Thank you so much. Sincerely, Alex Bogdalski. Tyrone Austin. Lainey Mitchell. Socrates Stansberry. David Adelstein. Tara Winton. Therese Mars. Aja Burks. Jimenez, get ready because graduation is coming and you are getting a ticket, front row seat, so mark your calendar.